Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. In tonight's video, I'm going to show how to make this uh, cluster of stars or whatever you want to call it using the blend tool and the control C, which is copy, and control V, which is paste. So we're just going to grab these and we're going to get them out of the way. We'll go ahead and create another star. You actually need two. I'm going to have no fill. And then I'm going to make a duplicate, so control D. So now we've got two stars. Then I'm going to take an eclipse, not necessarily, but I put it in the center of the page. We're going to go up to effects and go to contour. And I'm just going to go one inch and three steps to the inside. Now you need to break contour group apart. You need to select all these and you need to ungroup them. Un go ahead and do ungroup all. Then we're going to take these two stars and we're going to get the blend tool now. So go up to effects, down to blend. We've got those two stars selected. We only want like 15. Hit apply. Then click on this right here, new path and click on your new path. Then go to blend along full path and hit apply. Now we're going to take these stars and we're going to go control C and control V. We're going to put new path. We're going to go control C. We're going to go control V. New path. Control C, Control V. So what I'm doing is making a copy and then pasting it. New path. Then all you have to do is get all those and left click, no fill. Whoop. Right click, no fill. And there you go. It's not as big, as thick as that other one, so you could change it, you know, prior. But that way, it'll save you a lot of time of, of producing two stars and blending them together. You can just keep putting them on that path. So the Control C for stands for copy. They're right up here under Edit, Copy and Paste. Anyway, hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.